What's up guys, I'm Vern. I'm um, Hannah. Welcome to another edition of Foggy Boy Productions channel. So this is an early type of video, it's lunchtime. You hungry, Hannah? Always. So today we're going over to Bloomfield, New Jersey, to a place called Christos that makes the best cheesesteaks here in New Jersey. Yeah, okay, they always eat that. <laughs> <laughs> now we've tried a couple, right? We went to Babo's, but Babo's was more like a fat sandwich type thing. Yeah, right? yeah, yeah. And then we went to the one in Hoboken, which is pretty good too, right? Yeah. Supposedly this one, is as close as you can get to Philly's cheesesteak. So, I don't know, we'll see. We'll what do you think, see. Well, well, we gotta try. <laughs> That's why we're here. Yep. We'll give you a good review, and uh, hopefully you hungry, Aaron? Always. All right, let's go. Let's go. Oh, they changed the sign? I don't know, it's over there. It's called Wake and Steak. Chris, Crystal's Wake Steak. Right there. <laughs> Time for some cheese steaks. So I got some cheese steaks, yeah. Sorry about that. Hannah got some cheese steaks. And a lot of books. Sorry about the books. But uh sending it over to the Philippines, my sister and I. But we're gonna go eat. Cool with the Cooper's Cooper cheese. Hannah got the old school. We're gonna swap sandwiches. Yeah man, it's the way to do it. You can tell the difference because look at the cheese. Cheese whiz is on it. Yeah. And this one is Cooper. Cooper cheese. Cooper cheese. It looks like a American cheese, but Cooper brand. <laughs> yeah, it's uh, both got fried onions on it. Fries. Uh huh. Help yourself. How's the fries, honey? Tastes like fries. Tastes like potatoes. <laughs> <laughs> no salt. I don't taste the salt. So. How do you say it? Healthy fries. No. Very light on the salt. Yeah, very light and oh salt and pepper is in there. Well you could add more. Mm. We were gonna get it with cheese, but so expensive. More expensive, yeah. Two dollars more. Mm -hmm. It is time to taste the old school cheese stick. Um. It's actually good. Yeah. Mm -hmm. They said this is the next best thing to a, a Philly cheesesteak here in New Jersey. Well, I can't really compare Philly because I haven't tasted um, the Philly cheesesteaks in years, so I don't remember. But it has cheese whiz, fried onions, and then you get your uh, chopped up ribeye steak. Mm -hmm. It's good though. Good? Yeah. Is it as good as the one that we had in Hoboken? You remember the cheesesteak? Wait, where? Remember when we went to cheese, uh, Hoboken? I forgot the name of the place. I forgot. We did a video on it. But I, I think forgot. this is a, a little more meatier. Yeah, they have more a lot of meat in it. Yeah. You could actually I saw in the menu that you could add more meat for more extra money. Oh yeah? Yeah. For extra money you could have add more meat. Now you try I, know, that's, I think that's a lot of meat already. Yeah. This is the New School. New school. they just the difference the Cooper, is the cheese. And Cooper cheese. Yeah. Mm -hmm. See? Mmm. Mm. What do you think? Taste the difference. You can? Mm -hmm. You can definitely taste the cheese, right? Mm -hmm. 
that cheese makes a difference. Mm -hmm. But uh, if you had to choose one, which one would you choose? You're an old school kind of guy. Right? I am, but I like the cheese whiz, right? Yeah. But if you want more flavor, you, you go for the new school because the, the Cooper cheese puts out more flavor of the cheese than um, the cheese whiz. The cheese whiz, oh, yeah. cheese whiz is, you, you taste the cheese, but the Cooper enhances the, the flavor. The flavor of it. Because oh. it's, it's, like I said, it's like a, a white American, I think it's a white American cheese, the, the Cooper brand um, cheese that they use in this one. Nice. There you go. Mm -hmm. Vern's turn to try the cheese stick. Yeah, I'll try the old school first, like Hannah. You definitely could see more cheesy in here. Oh yeah, it's cheese whiz. Yeah. Hey, they mix the, they mix the cheese whiz with the with the meat. It's a lot of ribeye steak here. Oh, yeah. There you go. Mmm, what a big bite. <laughs> good. Yeah. What do you think? It's good. The fried onions are there. Oh yeah. But they do give you a healthy amount of meat. Yeah. Oh yeah. Hey, imagine you pay a little bit more, then you get more meat. Mm -hmm. That's a lot of meat. It is good. Yeah. Too bad I can't really compare it with the Philly ones because I haven't had Philly cheesesteak in a long, long, long time. But we are making a trip, right, Henner? Yes, we are. This year. So. so. Be sure to wait for that. We're going to do some more cheesesteak reviews. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So let me try the new school. Now the new school. Let's see what Vernon thinks. Look at that. It still has a lot more meat. Actually, one corner. And you can't really see. It. Yeah, it's more like white cheese, right, Hunter? Yeah, it's white American cheese, I think. Yeah. Wow. All right. All right, here we go. Ooh, look at that. <laughs> Big bite. Yeah. Mm. So, verdict? Yeah, you're right. The type of cheese they use makes it give it a different flavor to the old school. Yeah, it pops out the flavor, the the cheese and the meat a little bit more, right? Yeah, it's still good though. Like, yeah. What would you prefer then, if, if you had to choose between the one? I actually like the new school, but the Cooper cheese. You like the new school better? Yeah. Because of the taste of the cheese, right? Mm -hmm. It has more flavor? Yeah. Damn, look at that. Two bites is already done. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, definitely. But new think, school. But I would do the old school too. Yeah. But if I had to buy one, I'd take the new school. Because of the flavor, right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But you can't go wrong with either one. Oh yeah, definitely. Yeah. Can't go wrong with cheesesteak. Mm -hmm. And it's finally here in New Jersey. Yeah. I, I, I believe the hype, Hannah. <laughs> yeah, man. It's better off than driving two hours to Philly just to get cheesesteak. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> so yeah, there you go, folks. Vern's review on the cheesesteaks. Good stuff. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it can definitely taste the difference yeah. with both. Mm -hmm. Wow, there's a follow up. Cheese whiz, the old school, you taste the meat more. New school, you taste the cheese more. Mm -hmm. But, still both good. <coughs> Thumbs up. Come to Crystal's in Bloomfield. Mm -hmm. Good stuff, good stuff. You know what's the sign of good cheesesteak, Hunter? How messy it is. <laughs> the bread is nice and soft too. Yep. It's not like one of those hard... Um, mm -hmm. Hard breads. Hard breads. Mm -hmm. This one is still nice and soft. Yep. Fresh. Made fresh, yeah. as Bones would say. Made fresh. You know, we should copyright that now. Made fresh. <laughs> by Bonifacio Diasis. Rest in peace, Bones. Mm -hmm. Miss your brother. A month or so earlier. Next neighborhood. 
There's a barbershop. You got the Wake and Steak sign there. New Jersey right there. Let's see what's inside. This is the buffalo cheesesteak from Christos. Oh my god, look at that. I already like the presentation. Look at that. There's a lot of chicken there. I could I could definitely smell that buffalo sauce. Nice. White sauce. You gotta try it. Look at that, it's leaking out of the box. But um, I've heard good things about this place and uh, I'm going to try the steaks with Henner but today I tried the chicken. Let's take a bite and see how it tastes. Okay, I got the tissues on deck because I know this is going to be a messy one for sure. <laughs> oh man, that smell is making me really hungry but here it is. The buffalo chicken cheesesteak. Take a bite. Mmm. -hmm. Mm. That's outstanding. Nice spice levels. Soft bread with the poppy seeds on top. Oh man, I can't wait to taste the other cheesesteaks, the old school and the new school. But the buffalo cheesesteak really hits the spot. You got a generous amount of chicken in there too. All cut up in little pieces. Mm -hmm. How do you recommend this one? Don't no sleep on this. Buffalo cheesesteak, I know. People rave about the other cheesesteaks there, the old school and the new school. But, you know, this buffalo chicken cheesesteak, I'd order it again in a heartbeat for, for sure. If there wasn't any other cheesesteaks there, this will be on my number one list to get. This, this, this doesn't disappoint, tell you that much. Get it from Christos. Mm. All right, Henner. So uh, yeah, we uh, finished our cheesesteaks, just the fries. Henner didn't want to take it because you know carbs and sugar. Burning. No more sugar overload. Always burning. <laughs> you know. But yeah. Oh, see, you could tell that that was good. <laughs> <laughs> oh, excuse me. So yeah, there was the new school cheesesteak, the old school cheesesteak. We ordered some fries. I also ordered the buffalo cheesesteak. I put it in this video. But anyway, Henner, which one did you prefer? It's, I would say it's pretty even. Yeah, you can order I, it in either one. Yeah, I, I think it's more... A which preference, you, right? Preference and what, what you're in the mood for. Right, so, right. Like I mentioned, uh, the cheese whiz, you taste the meat more, not as much as the cheese. Then the, the Cooper, you taste the cheese more. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Yeah, it has a strong taste of the cheese. Yeah, and it's, they give you a very generous amount of Excuse me. ribeye steak there. <laughs> so. And you could order more at Henderson, right? Yeah, you, you pay a, a you pay a certain amount more. It says extra meat. If you know, I saw it in the I saw it in the menu, the board menu. Yeah. So, but um, what you get already is enough. And, yeah. uh, There's I'm, a lot of meat. Yeah. Uh, I'm full of so. Yeah. And yeah, I mean, if this is what to expect when we go to Philly, I'm excited. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Right, Henry? Oh yeah. So, um, it's also a road trip, so I'm excited for that. Yeah, road trips will be fun. Fun as heck. We're going to do that sometime in August, so keep an uh, eye out. And uh, I heard they also make good chopped cheese sandwiches here. I'll have to come back for that. Well, well, what's time. a chopped cheese sandwich? It's like they chop the cheese. It's like a cheese steak, but they chop the meat more or something. I don't know. I can't explain it. I you Someone know. from YouTube could probably describe it down below. <laughs> I might yeah. below if you guys know what that means. <laughs> so, yeah. Yeah, come to uh, Bloomfield. What's the name of this place? Christos? Christos. Uh, Wake and Steak. Wake says. and Steak, yeah. I yeah. was like, where is this damn thing? 
<laughs> yeah, it's right here in Bloomfield. You can't miss it. Yep. And uh, come hungry. Lots of food. Always. Food hungry. is pretty cheap. It's reasonable priced. Yes. And uh, yeah, it was busy inside too. Yeah, it was like thirteen fifty for the whole sandwich, yeah. which is not bad. And the size of the bread was uh, was pretty decent too. Yeah. And it's still soft. Made fresh. Made fresh. <laughs> so. Copyright pattern. <laughs> <laughs> so anyway, Hunter. Last words. Yes, please don't forget to comment and press that subscribe button. <laughs> and ring the bell, right? Ring the bell. Yes. Ding, ding, ding. See you guys. Bye. <laughs>